Okay, so we're back home and Bubba is sleeping. So let's do a haul. Um, so I'm just looking at the receipt here. It's always a good thing to keep your receipts just because uh, if you plan on posting it to sell and it doesn't sell within a week, you can get store credit. You have to pick something out and then like exchange it. But um, it's still pretty good. Like if you thought, like especially for a hefty, uh, a, a hefty amount. Oh, what am I trying to say? Heavily priced item. There we go. If you have a heavily priced item and it doesn't sell and you thought it was going to or it was just a little bit of a gamble, then uh, it comes in handy because then you can return it. So something that I found actually uh, before we went to the bathroom on the way out was this Marshall Stuffy and he's so cute. And my son is obsessed with Marshall, and it's Christmas soon, so I picked it up. He just needs a little bit of a wash. His hat is a little floppy, um, but I think that I can just sew it on. I think it just came undone in a couple spots on his head, but he's so cute. And he was uh, $6, and I know at Walmart... They're like 25 and it looks in pretty good condition. It just, like I said, he needs a wash and the hat needs to be sewn back on his head. But uh, anyways, next thing I got was uh, for $2.99 plus tax was this uh, bit of uh, Avon stuff. I didn't even look on, at it, honestly. I just saw the one, it just looks like a bunch of different nail polishes from Avon and it cost me three dollars plus tax now it's good I like to check out uh, the healthy health and beauty section now it sounds gross but the thing is uh, most not most things some things you can find are brand new in the box and uh, so there's nothing wrong with them and then it's a fraction of the price and it's great to have either to if you want something for yourself or a gift or if you're trying to resell it like I am it's always best to have uh, like brand new in the box I wouldn't buy anything um, that wasn't brand new unless you know how to sterilize it properly. Uh, some makeup pieces I know how to sterilize properly. It's pretty easy but still it's still a little bit of a risk and I wouldn't do anything like lipstick but um, anyways moving on that's a good spot to check out. So I have here a uh, men's actually I grabbed what is this? Oh, that's the Blue Jay shirt. So I grabbed a bit of men's shirts. Now, I find it's kind of weird because, um, well, it's not weird, but men's shirts are <laughs> cheaper. So they have, uh, you get a better net profit anyways. So this uh, snap-on sure it just has snap on uh 1920 to 19 9, uh, 1920 to 2015 on the front and then on the back it has again snap on in a uh, nice coloring and then the decal and um snap on's a tool company if you're not familiar so that'll make a good gift for uh, somebody who's into tools. Next, for $3, I got this Blue Jay shirt. Again, men's. So just simple Blue Jays. And it has on the back um, whatever that is. What is it? <laughs> Uh, Osana out of 54 or so. I don't know anything about Blue Jays, but people, um, I saw a couple posts of people asking for some Blue Jays uh, paraphernalia, so we'll see if we can sell it. And like I said, it was $3, and if I can't sell it, I can also return it for store credit. 
And then last I have a uh, top from, uh, where is it from again? Oh, right, it's from Torrid. I would honestly keep it if, uh, actually, I might try it on. But, see, this is the worst thing because I'm going to end up keeping a lot of the nice things. Anyways, I might just wear it a couple times and then post it on. But, um, it might be a bit too big for me. Anyways, and it just has these, like, straps that go along, like, the arms here. One moment. So it just has those, like, off, and it'll be on the shoulder. Um, and it's just a nice burgundy sweater. It's actually close to the color that I have. And it is a size, uh, what size is it? Come on. What size are you? Oh, uh, it's a size 4. I'm used to seeing things in, like, 4X. But because um, Torrid is just a plus-size brand, I guess it only has 4, like, no X. Because then that would make it extra, extra big. Anyways, so it's a 4X. Um, and I actually have a plus-size. Uh, I don't have it. I belong to a plus size um, buy and sell group on Facebook and Torrid goes like hotcakes because otherwise the sweater probably is like 60 bucks. And oh yeah, and I got it for um, $9.50. So we'll see if I can make a bit. I'm going to try to maybe go for, um, sell it for maybe 15 or 16 but that might be pushing it. I knew when I got it because it was nine fifty, I wasn't going to make all that much money on it, but, um, we'll see what we can do. The Marshall puppy for sure is being kept because, well, I wanted to get one at Walmart, but then I thought, well, you know what? It's right there. So might as well grab it, wash it, and then it's, a good gift for Christmas. Anyways, see you next time.